Yo, it's been a minute since we had some 21 pilots on the channel, so let's get to these 21 pilot requests. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano The Third, y'all guys' third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed and you like what you see at the end of the video, consider clicking the subscribe button bottom right hand corner. Now, like I said, it's been it's been months. I guess I, actually it's been since it's been since Level of Concern came out. The day it came out, that was the last 21 Pilots reaction that I did. Actually, I lied. I did the live version of the same song on Jimmy Kimmel, like maybe a couple weeks after that. But it's been some time since we had some on the channel, and we got request for them so this one right here as you can see is drowned by Tyler Joseph I'm assuming this is before this is before he was 21 pilots or the duo that is 21 pilots and this request comes from this request comes from Luke Greenwood Luke I appreciate you being on the tier that allows you to get a subscription in allows you to get a subscription allows you to get a request in this tier you're subscribed to on patreon anybody else that's subscribed on patreon either you're waiting for your request or you're subscribed at a lower tier every single dollar on patreon helps it allows me to keep making these videos with high quality at a very consistent pace now that I am full time on YouTube and y'all benefit from it and so does the entire channel. So I appreciate everybody that's over there on Patreon. If anybody wants to potentially see what Patreon is about, first link down in the description below. But that's pretty much all that I got for today. I'm excited to get into this one because from what I know, it is very early in their career or in his career or very early in his style. So I'm excited to hear it. Follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter at the third earnest, just like the channel. The links are down in the description below. And we got drowned by Tyler Joseph. Let's get it. Here I come, come to you in the van. His voice is so much stronger now. I uh, like these these lyrics are super vague, obviously. They're very I don't know if because I know that they had they are strong or, or at least Joseph Tyler Joseph uh, or uh, or if they're both pretty strongly tied to their religion. So I don't know if we're like on a religious theme right here, like like I'm, I'm walking in the very clothes I killed you in and I'm alone. It's, it's hard to say. So at least at least so early into the track. But his voice is super, super like not weak. It's just nowhere near as honed and it's nowhere near as perfected. Like, I guess I guess it doesn't sound as confident with his voice as he does now. It's crazy. I love hearing these type of tracks where I'm hearing like major artists and how they first started out. I walk to you, rain falls from you, can you wash me, can you drown? So much been up inside of me. I want to be strong too long. Yo, yo, before we get into the rap, it's already fire. It's already, it already sounds clean, especially with the beat drop and then his his higher pitched voice on top of it. But again, like I don't know what the lyrics are about. And I want to say they are about his his connection with God, but I can't say for certain because he's like, I look up to you and, and like you rain down upon me and and drown me like 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 wash me of my sins, like make me pure once more. You know, like I like I don't just just knowing from what I know who they are. That's the only reason why I'm going with that, but this could be this could be anything. It's so vague. I wanna be loud of things, so much been up inside of me. I wanna be strong and too long. I've sat here undecidingly, planning strategy Ooh. half of me. Knows the soul just a fallacy, failing miserably drastically, and then I crash dramatically into a wall. Alright, his his breath control is definitely not there for this pat for this speed of for the speed of, of rapping. But that's obviously something that comes with time. Like learning learning your voice, learning your style, le like learning your vocal and breath control, that, that allows you to like to that allows the flow to happen much too much more fluid, I guess you could say. Pun intended, no fun intended. But the rhyme schemes are definitely there. I wanna be a lot of things, so much pent up inside of me. I wanna be stronger too long. I've sat here undecidedly. Like like it's one, two, like it's A rhyme, A rhyme, B, B rhyme, A rhyme. A lot of things inside of me, stronger too long here undecidedly, like that's fire. Like I wanna be all these things, but something keeps holding me back. I wanna be a lot of things, so much pent up inside of me, but I've been sitting here too long. I've sat here undecidedly. I haven't, I haven't been making moves. I just been talking to talk, I haven't been doing 
doing what's necessary to walk the walk because I'm just sitting here undecidedly. And then he says, planning strategy, half of me knows it's all just a fallacy. Like like half of me believes in the dreams that I have, but the other half is gonna is gonna hold me back because I'm I'm still I'm still too unsure. Failing miserably, drastically, and then I crash dramatically. Like then the rhyme scheme's fire for sure. He had for me, knows the soul just a fallacy, failing miserably drastically, and then I crash dramatically into a wall. I've hit a hundred times before, and yet I still ignore the dark red blood stains on the floor, and I'm back ah. in front of you, Lord, with blood on the floor. Is a blood mine of yours? Don't want to do this anymore. Back. Yeah, in see, see, I, I figured we were talking to God, because this is like this is an internal struggle, an internal battle type of type of song, from what I can gather so far. So I figured like one, he's either battling with reality versus like how that religion fits into his reality, or he's battling with like internal. Demons telling him that he's not enough, that he'll never make it in in music, or he'll never make it to like he'll he'll never see out his full potential. But either way, he says I crash dramatically into a wall, even though even though I've planned it out, I still keep on planning and crashing into this wall that I've hit a hundred times before. Like why do I just keep ignoring the blood on the floor? Like the definition of insanity, like you keep doing the same thing, expecting a different result. Blood mine and yours don't want to do this anymore. Back and forth between me and me and who you call me to be. You see a man free who thinks he has to buy a key to a door, but he can't because he's poor and he can't fall down anymore because he's already on the floor. And he's Dog, the, the production switch up to bring in like that. I don't know if it's strings or I don't know if it's like very low horns, like like French horns. But like for to go from just one voice and then the multi stack and bring, bring two or three voices stacked together. Once that once that new horn comes in to let you know that we're transitioning into like a more climactic moment, that's fire. But you can definitely hear like the roughness of production because it doesn't sound as clear, doesn't sound as clean. He obviously doesn't have anywhere near the budget that he has as as, as the lead singer of Twenty One Pilots. But you can still get you can still get the vibe, you can still get the energy that he had very early on. It's, it's fire. He said back and forth between me and me and who you call me to be because they could be different people. Like I know that I need to I know that I need to walk the righteous path. I need to like I need to I need to follow your your guidance. But sometimes being me, it's like being human is a reality. You know, you see a man free who thinks he has to buy a key to a door, like a door that's going to unlock potential, but he can't because he's poor, not like physically poor, but like mentally, he's, he's not, he's not confident enough to, to walk through that door, much less even open it. Fall down anymore because he's already on the floor and his home has broken it all. And this is his call, but it's more of a cry because he will try nine times, realize nine crimes, but he has more than nine lives. So he picks himself up and keeps climbing for the prize again. See, like right there. Like right there at the very end, the flow started to break down. It started to like become off beat a little bit. At this point, it sounds for like he's trying to force the like he's trying to force the flow to match the beat. It's dope to like hear to hear to hear him struggle like that because everything that I've ever known about Twenty One Pilots is like a, a well polished, well oiled, like global superstar sensation machine. So I love going back and hearing like older tracks where they were trying to find their sound. And when I mean like stumbling over the track, I don't mean it in a bad way. I mean every artist, every artist. Has has to like try things and they have to experiment in order to find where what lane they belong in you know and know that lane was not an intended pun he says he will try nine times to realize nine crimes but he has more than nine lives so he picks himself up and keeps and keeps climbing for the prize that's dope like you only have as many lives as at least in what he's talking about like you only have as many lives as you're willing to keep trying to you're, tr you're willing to keep trying to get to the goal or the end result the moment that you stop getting up and stop trying that's really when you run out of lives but that's all that's that's determined by you that's not predetermined in advance you know here i come again to you just to show the blood so through through my bones and all i own is there a way for me to go i'm here just to show you that the blood soaked through my bones and everything that i own like i'm covered in your like I'm covered in your glory if we're still talking about God. Or it could be the blood from past mistakes from where he's hit the wall and he's finally learning like like to, to take a different path or he's finally learning and, and growing. So the blood has actually gotten through into his bones. I walk to you, rain falls from you, can you? Dope. can you wash me can you drown me and then it sounds like the it's the same type of like line and it's the same type of vibe where normally you know being drowned is not a good thing 
like normally you associate it with negative, but 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 he's saying like like normally you associate it with negative, but right here it's being associated with positive, and it's the same it's the same sentiment from the song chlorine. Like you would think sipping on straight chlorine is, is like is toxic, but it's actually cleansing. It's cleansing him and all of his and all the vibes that he's putting out there, all the vibes that he's receiving. And the same thing for like car radio, where he talks about like the negative the, the negative in his life of the car radio being stolen, but it allows him to confront his own internal demons and thoughts because he can't drown them out with with radio noise so like all these negatives that he's that you would normally associate with negatives he turns them into positive in his lyrics and that's that's dope every time i feel selfish ambition is taking my vision my crime is my sentence repentance is taking commission it's taking a toll on my soul i'm screaming submission and i don't know if i am dying or living because i will save a face for name a sake abuse of grace take a aim up to obtain a new name in a newer place but my name is lame I can't walk and i ain't the same and my name i became a new destiny to the grave and they say the ocean's blue see like like the flow is the flow is so rocky right here and i love that i love knowing that people that are graced with with talent still struggle and the rhyme scheme is crazy every time i feel selfish ambition taking my vision my crime is my sentence repentance is taking commission like bro that 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 internal rhyme scheme is crazy it's taking a toll on my soul and i'm screaming submission and i don't know if i'm dying or living that's 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 fire and again just like that internal struggle with himself like like strain away if i if i'm taking it into a religious context like strain away from the lord like like you're you're getting too far from your from your Christian background. That's why he said every time I feel selfish ambition is taking my vision, like it's blinding me from the faith because oh, like I'm too worried about my own goal and I'm not keeping you, God, at the center of who I am, you know? To the grave and they say the ocean's blue but it's black right now in the dark on the sand looking out at my crowd they're crashing and drowning singing out at four bars the lightning reveals when the ocean stops and the sky starts I've been told by the sky that the ocean I should win but it's all for me to see where ocean stops the sky begins a random shocks of light remind me of what is true but right now the ocean's black and Black. The sky is too. Bro, just his lyricism is nuts, bro. It's just like the fear of the unknown and then like having faith in or that that what you're doing is correct. Like the sky and the ocean, if one is bad and one is good, like like they both look the same in the dark. So I just have to walk by like blind faith, knowing that that I'm going to be okay. And then he like ties back in that lightning, random chunks of light, like remind me what's true, like reminds me that it separates it even for a brief moment of time. It separates the ocean and the sky, so I know what's true. Even though I look out and it all looks the same, I still have those those one flickering like moments of light where I can differentiate between the two so it helps keep me like tied to my faith. Light remind me of what is true, but right now the ocean's black and black. The sky is true. What's fire about this, especially like thinking about 21 Pilots now and trying to like trying to understand where he came from, because this clearly says just Tyler Joseph. So I'm assuming Josh isn't even part of this track. And what's dope is that like like it sounds like it's just missing that X factor that makes 21 Pilots as good as they are. And that X factor is Josh and his drumming capability, like like what he can do with the drumsticks. Like it just solidifies even further that the two complement each other in the way that they do, because Josh on his own isn't a superstar and Tyler joseph on his own isn't a superstar because clearly right here it sounds like something is missing and that's josh on the drum so like them two like blending and, and making their sound and their songwriting like they they mix together so well that's what makes them 21 pilots Whoa. yo i like that fade like at the very end of his like last note that he's screaming I like that fade to go back and forth and then like like the background vocals like they fade on the opposite direction of like that one note that he's screaming so as it's coming left like they're coming right that's dope yo that right there like it like it's not obviously it's not the best song it's, 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 it's like it sounds like demo it's always fire to go back and hear to go back and hear where they came from and how their sound has evolved but the core of it is still stayed the same because this sounds like like it sounds like a 21 pilot song it sounds like the lyrics the crypticness like the the faith everything right there is in there but it's just missing that one piece and that one piece is josh but yo 
That brings us to the end of this video, ladies and gentlemen. I appreciate your time. If you like what you see, please consider liking the video, leaving a comment down below. If you like what you see enough, please consider subscribing. Luke, I really appreciate this request, man, because I love, love going back and hearing big time artists and hear where they came from. And this gives me that like, it gives me that feel and it gives me that feeling like if I found them 10 years ago and I heard this track and I would be like, yo, these dudes are gonna blow up. It's the same feeling that I have with The Weeknd. I always mention it on Weeknd tracks is that I found him when he was nobody, like when he, like when the mixtapes were barely becoming popular. And I was like, this sound, this dude is gonna take over the music industry. And it's cool to like, to be able to say that I, that I found, I found that artist at that time when they were barely budding and becoming who they could be. And, and the same is said for like, for this track, for people that know this track before 21 Pilots was even 21 Pilots. So it makes me happy to like, to get to experience that with people who already know what this is about. Follow your boy on Instagram, Twitter and on Discord, all three linked down in the description below. I am highly active on all three. So if you wanna see my daily life or just like dumb things that think in my head, Instagram and Twitter. And if you actually wanna to talk to me, then hit up the Discord, cause that's the best place to do it. But that's all that I got for today, ladies and gentlemen. I appreciate your time. Like I always say at the end of all of my videos, go out there in the world, love and care for one another, love and care for each other. And I'll catch everybody on the next video. Peace.